Ukraine received a new type of French Mirage 2000 fighter jet this month, ahead of schedule. Reports suggest it is the 2000-5F version. While not the newest aircraft, it is a valuable upgrade for the Ukrainian Air Force. With the reported air-to-ground package upgrade, the Delta Wing aircraft can fill an important gap in Ukrainian defenses. Even a few of these planes will force Russia to rethink its strategy. The Mirage 2005 is a fourth-generation fighter that Ukraine has already received, and like the F-16, offers both advanced avionics and multi-role capabilities. Developed during the Cold War and upgraded over the years, it remains a strong fighter. According to French reports, the version sent to Ukraine includes advanced electronic warfare systems and the RDY-2 pulse Doppler radar. This radar can track 24 aircraft and target four of them at once, up to 130 kilometers away. Reports suggest Ukraine received the upgraded Mirage 2005F version, which is at least on par with most modern Russian aircraft. Ukraine's Mirage 2000 likely comes with the ICMS electronic defense system. This includes radar warning receivers, jammers, and flare dispensers. The latest Mark. 3 version operates automatically to protect the aircraft, while the Mark 2 version requires partial input from the pilot. It is unclear which version Ukraine received. The Mirage 2000-5's main anti-air missile is the MICA. It can engage targets both within and beyond visual range. For longer ranges, the missile relies on the Mirage's RDY-2 radar via datalink for guidance initially before using its own onboard sensor, either via radar or infrared, to hone in on its target, much like the American AIM-120 AMRAM. The latest version of MICAs can even hit targets behind the aircraft via datalink from a different aircraft. However, it is unclear which MICA versions, if any, were delivered to Ukraine alongside the Mirage's. Most reports suggest the Mirage 2000-5 that Ukraine has received has a glass cockpit, replacing old analog dials with multifunction displays, commonly known as MFDs. This gives pilots better situational awareness, reducing fatigue and mistakes. Compared to older Soviet aircraft, Ukrainian pilots in the Mirage 2000 will have a clearer view of the battlefield and react faster in combat, all thanks to the modern avionics on board. Despite its strengths, the Mirage 2000-5F is still a fourth-generation fighter, similar in classification to Russia's Su-35 and Ukraine's F-16s, though each has different performance characteristics. It lacks the stealth of fifth-generation jets like Russia's Su-57 or the US F-35. Against advanced Russian air defenses like the S-300 and S-400 surface-to-air missile systems, the Mirage remains vulnerable just like other fourth-generation fighters. In a straight air-to-air -air fight, a Russian pilot flying a Su-57 will likely have the upper hand, theoretically detecting the mirages first before the latter can react. However, Russia is believed to have only up to 15 operational Su-57s in service, and their true capabilities, including stealth performances, are still being debated. Air combat is not just about the pilot. It requires a team including radar operators, intelligence officers, maintenance crews, and planners. A single mistake from any team member can lead to a downed aircraft. This applies to both Ukrainian and Russian forces. Over the last three years, the Ukrainian Air Force has already proven skilled at using older aircraft to deceive and outmaneuver Russian forces, using a combination of aircraft and air defenses to offset Russia's theoretical air superiority. The Mirage 2000 will make them even more effective. Ukraine has spent years adapting Western weapons to its Soviet-era aircraft. Now, rather than jerry-rigging NATO weapons on Soviet-era warplanes, the Mirage 2000 provides a much better platform for air-to-ground attacks. The ground attack systems aboard the jet, such as the RDY-2 radar's synthetic aperture ground mapping mode and targeting pod integration, were designed specifically to help the pilot put a scout missile or a hammer precision-guided munition, PGM, on target and get away safely. In short, the new Mirage aircraft will likely help Ukraine attack ground targets more effectively. Reports indicate that Ukraine has received between three and six Mirage 2000 fighters, though exact numbers remain classified. 
This is not enough to change the course of the war alone, but enough to complicate Russian air defenses. These jets will improve Ukraine's ability to strike ground targets and engage Russian aircraft, adding another challenge for Russia in the ongoing conflict. The arrival of the Mirage 2000-5 is an important step for Ukraine's air force. While not a game-changer by itself, it strengthens Ukraine's ability to fight back. How effective will these jets be? We will see. But for now, Russia's air superiority is a little less superior, thanks to a little help from the French.